All right, well, it's a windy, windy opening day of rifle season here in Missouri, and we didn't kill a deer during youth season, did we? Come close, uh, didn't have the best of luck, and uh, made a shot, but we uh, we didn't kill one, did we? No, but it was fun, and it's rifle season, regular firearm season, and uh, we're coming out here. Gonna give it a try again. We're going to the same spot because the trail cameras show that they're there. And uh, I actually went in last week and I cut down a better shooting lane for her because this deer I could see and she couldn't for a little while. So I wanted to uh, cut down a couple of them cedar trees so she could get a better shot, take her time a little bit more, um, and uh, hopefully kill her first deer. So we're going to get back out there. You got anything good to say? No. No? Nothing good to say. Hope she kills a deer though. All right, guys, we'll go get in the blind. All right, we made it to the blind. We're after them. We got about a three hour sit. We got a better shooting lane this time. We're ready. Whew, I hope one comes by. I think we'll get one. Trail camera shows every evening some deer coming by, so we'll see. Some does, a little spike, four pointers. We'll see what happens. It's windy today, but it's in our favor, so it should be good. Yeah, that was good. Yeah. Give it a good short. Perfect. A little slower, but perfect. Let me try it again. Yeah, a little longer now. We might call something in like that. That was good. Oh, you got him, baby girl. Oh, my gosh. I don't think we even recorded. It's fine. It's fine. It's down. Oh, my gosh. I got him. Molly got her a buck. Good job. What do you think? Did. How was that? Good. You didn't even use the rest. We used the blinds and you got one. Oh, I'm so proud of you, girl. I don't even know if I recorded it. I don't think <laughs> I did. All right, guys, we got out of the blind. Ellie? I'm so excited. Oh, we got us some buck. <laughs> so excited. Oh, okay, all right. You want to go find her first deer? We don't have to find it. Oh, we don't have to find it. That's right. We're going to go put your hands on your first deer. Oh, he's... <laughs> He smelt us and he was getting out of there. Hey, hang on. Is mom in there? I texted her, told her buck down. Mm -hmm. Ellie, what do you have here, baby girl? <laughs> so excited. Hey. Let's, hang on, let, let's do the poke. 
<laughs> All right, pick his head up. Let's see what you got there. Scared? Don't be scared. You made a perfect neck shot too, by the way. <laughs> Turn it this way. Look at what you got. I'll help you. Look at what you got, baby. Where's his other handbook? He, he didn't have it. I've got trail cam pictures of him. <laughs> you got buck fever? <laughs> I think you got buck fever a little bit, huh? So excited. Oh, I'm so proud of you. Look at that shot. Is that where you was aiming? Yeah. All right. She said earlier today, guys, she said, if I see a buck or any deer, I'm shooting it in the neck because I don't want to track you off. <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh. Yeah. All right, Ellie. <laughs> this is mine. <laughs> it is a big one. You got you a good one, girl. Oh, I'm so proud of you. Oh my God. This buck came in when, uh, and I had to shoot it not on the thing because I couldn't, because it was all the way over here, yeah. and not over there. Yeah, she's got a rest That's in there. That's fine. That's, you're a hunter now. Look at that. Yeah, she got a rest, guys, and. Uh, we actually picked her gun up, put it on the blind, and used it as a rest, and she maneuvered around and made a perfect shot. What do you think? I think huh? it's a good one. <laughs> I'm so proud of you. You're the cutest thing <laughs> out here. Hey, super proud of you. You didn't give up after youth season and uh, come out here and just killed one, smoked it. What's your favorite deer meat recipe that we're going to cook up? Um... The chewy jerky. Oh yeah, yeah, we're gonna make some jerky and then we shred it. Yeah, make it like a jerky chew. Mm -hmm. All right, guys, this is Ellie's beautiful first deer. Nice four-pointer, would have been an eight, but he just broke up. Does it get better than that? Mm -hmm. No. <laughs> so this is the best week ever because Friday, I got cupcakes and pizza, and now Saturday I got a big deer. All right, well, it's been almost a week since uh, Carson on opening day shot at a spike. Looked like we hit the off front shoulder. Didn't make the greatest shot, but trail camera's still, still showing some deer in there. We never found the spike. Um, we did a little target practicing earlier today. Uh, he's shooting my 6.5 Creedmoor. Um, but this is also going to be his attempt at shooting one by himself. He said he didn't want to uh, hunt with me today. Didn't say that. <laughs> now, he does want to try to uh, shoot one by himself. Uh, I remember when I was by myself, shot my first deer, so as much as I want to tag along and video it, I'm going to go hunt a different blind tonight and hope he gets one. We'll video recovery of it and maybe we'll both get one. He's got his mom's gloves on, so he should uh, have no problem shooting one. She's got the good luck. So what do you got to say today? I'm going to kill a deer. I like the confidence. All right. Good luck, buddy. Call me if you need something. Okay. All right. Well, I don't know quite how I feel about that. Been hunting with him since he was six years old. He's 13 now. Got his hunter safety course. So he can hunt by himself. Yeah. Kind of feels weird letting him go out, but by himself anyways. Yeah, Lee, I don't know if I was ready for that. All right, guys, I just heard Carson shoot. I texted him. He said it was him. Let me give him a phone call. He's by himself, his first solo hunt. Hey, what'd you shoot? Oh, it was a doe. And I grunted, and I didn't see her. She was, like, way tucked in. 
I grunted, and she looked at me. I was like, oh, I'm busted. And then she started walking in the middle. I shot her right behind her leg, and I saw the hole. And she was walking really slowly uh-huh. and, like, kind of limping a little bit. But I hit her perfect. I could see the hole in her. All right. You, st- you stay put. I'm going to wait 20 minutes, and I will be there, okay? Okay. Oh, I'm so excited. Yep. Okay. All right. Congratulations, big guy. Thank you. Yeah. All right. Bye. Gloves to work for you. Yeah. Okay, so that was bad. Okay, so pretty much I was sitting there and I just got done texting Abel. I was like, I'm sitting or are you counting right now? And I was just texting him real quick. And I look up and I didn't see anything. I bent down, I was gonna grunt call real quick, and I started grunt calling and I look over and I see a doe and I put it down really slow and then she starts eating. I get my gun up and she come to about like right there. She was really close. Oh, she was right here? Yeah, she was like right, right here. here. Yeah, and then she took a big loop and went in right there. After you shot? Yeah. Oh. It, it was really slow, and I saw the hole. Oh, okay. Like, well, if she ran all that slow, then I'd say you got her. <sighs> all right, buddy. Let's take up the track here. I'm proud of you. Yeah, I, like, saw the hole. And I didn't all right. You can see it. I mean... It could just be filling up with blood right yeah, now. Yeah, well, she's bleeding going downhill, so that's good. But there's good blood right there, guys. Okay, so I went ahead and took another shot. We found her. I got shot her, and it wasn't a great shot, so I just made another one. Yeah. So we snuck up, found blood. She's been bedded down in here, and she was right there. He just put another shot on her, guys. Yeah. Hi. Yeah. That's uh, all right. Yeah. No, it's all right. Hey, your first one? First one of the season. Uh huh. By yeah. myself, technically. Yeah. Kinda. No, that's your first one ever solo, buddy. Yeah. I mean, shoot, yeah. Took two shots. We'll let her uh, go ahead and expire. Good track job. Thank you. Yeah. I was like, I was like, God, I see her right there. I'm... What a track job, little man. Uh, you know, sometimes things like that happen, and uh, we're thankful to uh, been able to find a good blood trail. And uh, we jumped her once, saw that she come up on this hill, uh, so we just quietly snuck up here, and she was bedded down 10 yards from us. Uh, couldn't really get up, and uh, he went ahead and put a second shot on her. We're gonna go. He's gonna go put his hands on his first deer solo killed so guys i finally got my first deer all by myself hunting all by myself and it's really like it's beautiful it's pretty big and i when i shot i shot a little low so uh whenever we got up here it wasn't still full or it wasn't fully dead so i wanted to make sure that i got a quick clean ethical kill and i shot it in the head and I'm very proud of myself. I'm very proud of you. You've done a great job. And uh, I don't think uh, anything could have turned out different, you know, like any better. We got a dead deer. Yeah. You got one on a solo trip, buddy. Yeah. How's it feel? It feels great. Yeah. Doing everything by yourself. Mm-hmm. Well, I was getting ready to call because I didn't see her because I looked down and I was texting my friend. And I looked back up and I didn't see anything, so I reached down for my call. When I started calling, I saw her, and I just set my call back down real quick. And when she started eating again, I put my gun up, and I just shot her where I thought was good. I thought I shot her right in here, but I shot her, like, right here. I mean, it's exactly where I was aiming, because I think her leg, she's kind of, like, bent down oh, okay. a little bit. Yeah, that makes sense, yeah. Say, so she might have been angled to you or something because it exited out the, the gut. Yeah. But, hey super proud of you buddy got some jerky some back straps yeah. we're ready was, you know what this means though since you don't anything by yourself you no. get to you get to gut it by yourself especially since you gut shot it too <laughs> yes sir Darn it. Okay. Let's, let's go <laughs> okay. all right give me an outro 
uh, this was my deer that I got all by myself. Peace out. All right, guys, so my buddy Bill, he designed a pretty cool way to load up deer in the back of the side by side with a tilt bed. I'll show you guys the process. the front and back legs together. Hold hey, it. Up there. Up there on the Right here. Because out and in. Oh, it's not Less than two minutes. Pretty sweet. That's still good. There you go. Good job, buddy. Thank you. Proud of you.